Turkish President Erdogan slams U.S. decision to deploy warships over Gaza. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has criticized the U.S. for sending a group of warships to the eastern Mediterranean to show support for Israel after this weekend's deadly attack by Palestinian militant group Hamas. In a joint press conference with visiting Austrian Chancellor Karl Niehammer in Ankara late Tuesday, Erdogan said, what is the U.S. aircraft carrier doing in Israel? He warned that U.S. involvement in the Gaza Strip would risk massacres escalating his rhetoric against the U.S. The U.S. said on Sunday it was dispatching the USS Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group, which includes an aircraft carrier, guided missile cruiser and missile destroyers, as a deterrent. The U.S. has offered Israel equipment and munitions as it hits back against Hamas, but there has been no suggestion so far that American warships would enter the fray. Erdogan's criticism comes as Turkey, which supports the Palestinian quest for an independent state, works to avert a broader escalation. The Turkish leader warned that a prolonged conflict risks engulfing the Middle East and criticized Israel's decision to cut off water and electricity to the isolated enclave. The combined death toll on the fifth day of the war has already exceeded 2,000, including more than 1,200 Israelis. Israel has in the past accused Turkey of supporting Hamas, which rules the Gaza Strip. The U.S. considers the Islamist militant group a terrorist organization. Turkey does not. The U.S. and Turkey are NATO allies. What will it do with all its boats and planes on the aircraft carrier that comes here? Erdogan said. Erdogan discussed in a phone call with Russia's Vladimir Putin late Tuesday ways to stop the conflict from spreading, the Turkish presidency said. His comments come after the U.S. shot down an armed Turkish drone that flew too close to American ground forces during air raids last week against U.S.-backed Kurdish militants in Syria. Erdogan's comments threatened to set back a nascent thaw in Turkey's ties with Israel. Relations nosedived in 2010 over a deadly Israeli raid on a civilian Turkish flotilla that was carrying pro-Palestinian activists to Gaza. Analysis Erdogan's criticism of the U.S. decision to deploy warships to the eastern Mediterranean is a sign of the growing tensions between the two countries. Turkey has long been a vocal critic of Israel's policies towards the Palestinians, and the latest round of violence in Gaza has only served to deepen these divisions. The U.S. deployment of warships is seen by many as a show of support for Israel and a warning to Hamas. However, it is also likely to be seen as a provocation by Turkey, which has its own interests in the region. The escalation of rhetoric between Turkey and the U.S. is a worrying development. The two countries are NATO allies, and a serious rift between them could have far-reaching consequences for security in the region. It is important to note that Erdogan's comments are also likely to be influenced by domestic political considerations. He is facing increasing challenges to his authority, and his criticism of the U.S. may be seen as an attempt to rally nationalist support behind him. It remains to be seen how the U.S. will respond to Erdogan's comments. The U.S. has said that the deployment of warships is a routine rotation of forces and is not intended to send a message to any particular country. However, Erdogan's comments suggest that the deployment could have unintended consequences.